Climate change has made extreme weather the new normal, with longer and more frequent droughts and heavier floods. To prepare for California's increasingly unpredictable climate, Valley Water is exploring options to store more water locally with the proposed expansion of Pacheco Reservoir. The most important reason why we're expanding the reservoir is for the citizens of South County and Santa Clara County that depend on a sustainable water source. The proposed expansion will nearly double how much water can be stored in Santa Clara County. The expansion would make the reservoir 25 times larger able to store enough water for 1.4 million people for one year in an emergency. A lifeline to weather future droughts. Going forward, we believe that this is probably the way it's going to be. We're going to see many years of drought and we need to be prepared for that. It would be a critical water supply hub moving forward, both from an emergency supply perspective uh, and a resiliency perspective. The project includes significant environmental benefits. A planned mile and a half creek restoration would provide new habitat for threatened fish species and increased water releases would improve 10 miles of downstream creek habitat. There are important changes to the project. After geotechnical surveying, the proposed dam site has moved from just upstream of the existing dam to a new location about one mile farther upstream. The new dam site is a little bit narrower in the canyon, which will allow us to minimize the volume of the dam, and it basically makes the construction of the emergency spillway a little bit easier. The new location would inundate about 13 acres of the 87,000-acre Henry Coe State Park when Pacheco is at capacity. Valley Water is committed to collaborating with California State Parks to address those impacts with a goal of providing enhancements to the park for the region's benefit. Meanwhile, the state of California has already determined the project will receive $500 million in funding, and Valley Water is exploring low-cost federal loans and funding as well. The reason that we're looking at all these sources of funding is because, of course, we want to minimize the impact to the community here so that locally we can pay as little as possible and try to rely on the federal and state governments to help us with this because this project is really a regional project. As we feel the impacts of our changing weather, expanding Pacheco would create an important line of defense, providing additional capacity to save water when it's there for times when it's not. This project really is designed for the future. With climate change creating a more extreme weather pattern, we expect that we're going to see early snow melt in the Sierras and it's going to run off quicker in the spring. So when we do actually have snow and runoff, we want to be able to capture it. Having another water storage of the capacity of Pacheco would again ensure a water supply for our future, for our residents and the two million constituents that we represent in Valley Water.